Hey sis, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you don't already know me, then hey, my name is Jillian. I am a flight attendant. So, hello, hello, hello. It's been so long. It is Saturday, July 22nd. I haven't vlogged since, honestly, I don't know, maybe... March, April, May. like I literally don't know. I haven't vlogged in so long, but you guys have been getting vlogs because the vlogs are like months behind real time. And I'm trying to catch up. I'm trying to get closer to real time. But yeah, today's the 22nd. It's Saturday. I'm off today. I've actually been off for like the past three days because the trip that I had before let me see if I can explain this so I had a trip that started on the 16th and on that trip I had a day that went past our contracted like duty day time and so for my trip that I had originally planned to start on the 19th they had to pull that trip so they pulled that trip and I've been off since the 19th but I've been getting paid. I got paid for that trip. Still, thank the Lord for that. I needed these. I needed these days off. But today, the twenty second, I was off. I am off. I am straight off. And yeah, I have some errands to run. As you guys can see, I'm in a vehicle. I went and rented a car this morning because I do have some errands to run. I'm looking like a little boy as you can see I have an appointment to go get my hair braided and I have a wig that I purchased that I'm going to install today so hopefully that turns out well I was watching some videos yesterday and yeah wow my battery's already trying to die y'all oh my goodness something told me to charge my freaking camera batteries yesterday ah! okay so my camera died of course it freaking did and yeah i'm vlogging on my phone now i don't know what the what you guys are seeing because i cannot see so yeah i want to try to get my laundry washed and dried before then so that my stuff is not sitting here at the laundromat and yeah so i have an hour to get it all done and get to the braiding salon and i might have to get cash out i don't even know how they accept payments so yeah that and then i have to install the wig once I get home, I also have to go to Target or Walmart just to get like some food items to um, to have to be able to cook for my coming up trips. I do have a trip that starts tomorrow. It's only a two day with a Philly layover. We love that. Um, but yeah, I need to get some food items and I need to go to the hair store. I need to go to the hair store before I obviously go home and do the wig install. So I want to do all my errands first and then come home, do my wig install and be done for the day. I want to be done by like three o'clock, everything. So, but yeah, guys, welcome to the vlog. This is going to be a spend a day off with me because I do have a life outside of being a flight attendant. And I want to show you guys, you know, my life me outside of work and i hope you guys enjoy so let's go let's get the laundry started and get the day started low motion for me Okay, y'all, so I'm back in the car. I'm back at the laundromat. I just put my clothes in the dryer. So they are drying. It is now 12.31 in the afternoon. 
I'm clearly not at the hair salon. Clearly hair is not done. So yeah, I called the lady and asked her if it was okay if I came a bit later and she said that was fine so i'm grateful for that while the clothes were in the wash i went to the hair store because we did have to go to the hair store and i got all of the things that i needed and i'll just show you guys what i got so i got this black spray on dye for like when you install the wig and like you put the comb down to like make your part like straight and like straight <laughs> it was on a video listen i got a cream foundation to put on the lace i got these hair clips to use for like when i'm straightening my hair no when she was installing the girl that i watched video the girl's video that i watched yesterday she used like clips to clip back her hair like as she was melting her lace so I thought I should get them <laughs> and I got some more of this got to be spray I got a lace wig bond conditioning remover this is to remove the lace glue when you're ready to take it off because the girls acting like you need to use these things to be safe and such so i just got a cheap little one and i got two razors to use to like cut my baby hairs when i'm doing my baby hairs and then i just got another right tail comb to add to the collection and that was it everything else i already have a lace glue the wig and everything else that i may need so I'm excited to do it. I hope it turns out really good. I believe in myself. So, yeah. I'm just I'm just going to be sitting here. Oh, I also got um another Blistex because my freaking Blistex I washed it. So, there's that. Um yeah. So I got another Blistex. But yeah, yeah I'm going to just be sitting here waiting for my clothes and things to dry and then i'm gonna go to the hair salon and hopefully it is not too late once i go and get my hair washed and braided i'm going to go home drop off my clothes put them away and then install my wig and then go to walmart and get like the food and little stuff that i need to get i was going to because in the same plaza where the hair store was there was a walmart i was going to go to the walmart then but i'm like if i get food and stuff like it's just going to be sitting in the car like that's not good so no bueno so yeah i'm gonna just wait to do that after I've been a little stressed but I'm easily stressed I am easily stressed I will say that I do need to work on like being so easily stressed with things and also my patience like God is really testing me to like learn patience and I'm being so like hard-headed but I need to get my patience together I also need to get something to eat throughout the day and I also need to take out the salmon that I'm going to make tonight. I'm going to make salmon for tonight and for my trip tomorrow. So, I need to do that at some point. But yeah, y'all, it's summertime. Summer flying. Summer flying has been stress foul, okay? I was under the impression that summer flying would be better than winter flying because the weather is better in the summer in the winter is snowstorms and rain and cold and all that but no like in the summer is worse the weather is worse in the skies like 
oh my gosh the amount of delays like like i just told y'all on my last trip our duty day got extended to like 13 and a half hours and like 12 and a half is like the limit like what what is going on so yeah summer has been kicking my behind in terms of work <sighs> like i need a trip i need a vacation we did also recently bid for vacation um the bids were due on the 20th this dragon fly will not get away from the, the car what we bid for vacation the deadline was the 20th i think the the awards don't come out until the 27th i don't know I don't remember, but I want to see what I get for vacation. We get two weeks for vacation. Ah, like that's crazy to me. I feel like that's a lot, but I asked for vacation in January because my birthday's in January, first week of January, and then the second week of May because me and my friends are planning a trip to Aruba for May 2024. So hopefully, I get what i asked for and people were telling me that i pretty much should because january after is right after the holidays like everybody has or all the senior people have taken like their vacations for christmas and new year's and stuff like that so i'm hoping everybody is back at home and broke by the time my birthday comes around and i can non-rev to wherever easily and peacefully definitely definitely need a vacation i do have a puerto rico trip planned for the end of august next month so i'm excited for that i've been ordering things like clothes and stuff to wear for that i already made my hair appointment i'm gonna get my hair braided for puerto rico so i can be in the water in the agua so yeah things are looking up like things are looking up things have been a trying it has been a trying time but i feel like things are going up from here so hopefully i am correct <laughs> But yeah, y'all, I'm just trying to talk to y'all, catch y'all up with what's been going on because I haven't talked to y'all in like months. Like I did do my update video, so I did talk to y'all a little bit about things in that video. But if you haven't already, make sure that you subscribe so that you can catch the vibes like travel vlogs coming up, more flight attendant content coming up all the things so definitely make sure you subscribe Woo! it's 12 41 now i don't know what to do with myself my dad camera's in the back and i'm just rambling at this point so i'll see you guys when i am going to the hair salon <laughs> Okay, y'all, so I am back home in my air conditioning. Got my hat on still, but I did get my hair braided. It looks nice and neat and hopefully flat for the install. And I'm ready to install my wig, which is right here. Hello. I did stop and get some food. I was craving some really good soul food. 
macaroni and cheese. I haven't had macaroni and cheese in a while. So I got this. I just looked up a, a place on Google. I'm not really too picky when it comes to food. I just looked at the pictures and like, okay, that looks good. So let's get it. And this is how it looks. It looks good. I think it's like four or five wings, mac and cheese, and collard greens. And I'm having my favorite brand of drink, a Calypso. I told you guys about these already. Strawberry lemonade isn't my favorite flavor, but I it's okay. I can do it. Um, my favorite is the... I don't even remember. It's like the berry, like like the melon, melon lemonade or something like that. But I haven't been able to find those here. But anyway, back in the house, about to eat. Oh, and I also got a chocolate cake. Ah! I'm not going to have that right now. No, I'm going to have it tonight after I eat dinner. And yeah, I wanted to show y'all the food really quick because I'm about to tear this up. I'm so hungry. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I do have to go back out again. I forgot that I had to drop a package off at UPS. So I have to drop that off before nine. There was something else. Oh, Walmart. Remember, I got to go to Walmart. Walmart is literally up the street from my house so I I drove over there because I'm like oh well I'm, I'm passing it I might as well go now but it was so many cars in that parking lot so many people I was just like I don't feel like doing this <laughs> I don't feel like doing this right now so I came home and I'm like let me just eat refresh regroup do my hair and then I'll come back out tonight when it's like seven o'clock no people out people are back home having dinner with their families like i i can't do it <laughs> i don't like being around too many people like i do it enough at work so <sighs> yeah back in the house <laughs> as i've already said like three times eating So you're home full time with the kids, huh? That was me, until the economy collapsed, and then I had to go back to work. You okay, Jackie. Join her, Percy. Treat me with more respect. As more of a partner, I can imagine. It's as though he... I was gonna be. I know that. Howdy. So I reached. Oh, for a town. For the record. How does he know about my good menu? Grace again. I swear she is always watching us. Honey, so what? Neighbors are weird. It's like, uh, you know, a wall. Yeah! Abby, what is up with the screaming? Come on, guys. Hey, what about you, Amber? Are you excited for school? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it has something to do with the fact that I spent the last two years trying... <sighs> She's a game. So he's watching us. Ignore them. They're animals. You shouldn't be so cut. That's too sexy. Is this one a little bit better? Oh, that's way too sexy. Perhaps I go with something a little more... Mm, no, that's annoying. What about the Russian? You like Russian? Mm -hmm. Possiblemente una idioma diferente. No. You're absolutely positive that this... It's unrelated. This is absurd. Our children receive a perfectly thorough education at home. Husband. Okay, it's all time. Doing, I'm putting my cat down right now. And I got a pot each. I forgot what I ordered. It wasn't anything big. Oh, it was just like um, wig straps. I just got the two edge <gasps> Baby, you got a body like Ben's. I'm just trying to drive it once again. Oh, 
go in with their belt belt and just put that right up. Put that right up. Just fry that thing real good. Oh. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> I'm almost done. I just ran to try to catch um, the UPS access point to drop off my package and they, the access point couldn't print out the, the label. So if I was able to print out the label ahead of time, then they would be able to take it, but they were not. So that was a little bit of a waste of time. And yeah, so now when I get to Philly tomorrow, I have to just find a UPS there. And luckily we stay downtown, so there should be definitely a UPS there. If I'm not mistaken, it should be a UPS store downtown. 